I said that was going to be my last one last episode for my recording session, but I feel like we're getting really close to the end. We're on chapter 16, which I think is the last chapter. I don't actually know. But damn. Bro, that's fucking wild. Dixon, why? Why, old man? Are you completely out of your mind? Ah, don't you kids ever shut up. I'm just doing my job, as always. I guess right? that makes the most sense why he would be Who able to make the Makanis destroying it's weapons. You. Who's that yes. guy? Now you remember. It's been a long time, hasn't it, Eggle? Too long. Huh? Zanza's disciple. Zanza's disciple. Oh, he's Zanza's disciple. Eggle, what do you mean? Oh. Dixon, what are you? I don't have to explain anything. As they say, seeing is believing. Now. Holy fuck! It with your own eyes. The moment of Lord Zanza's return. Okay, so he's not Zanza. He's Zanza's disciple, and he's him. gonna revive Zanza. Okay. Zanza, I did not know this. this. Damn. Zanza OP, not gonna lie. Why didn't we get that in Smash? What is happening? Ah, yes. Shulk! Wait, who's this guy? Zanza. Do not be surprised. Everything in this world is dictated by the passage of fate. Mm hmm okay. As all that exists is interconnected. I knew this, at least. Time can flow only towards the inevitable. Is that what? That is the vision of which I, Zanzo. the Monado, and the origin. Is it? Yeah. That which will be, will be. This was all predestined. Ever since I came to reside within Shulk. Mm -hmm. What do you mean? Zanza grew tired from our battle. And then the High Entia ancestors trapped him. His flesh was sealed away on Prison Island. His soul, and hence the Monado, was confined to Ossie But Tower. when he released... Those ruins? But what does this have to do with Shulk? Did you forget? Who discovered those ruins? Who happened to be there? Who was the survivor we found? Right. And who brought back that survivor? What are you saying? You planned all this when you found Shulk. Jackpot. It was all for this day. In fact, there was never anyone called Shulk to begin with. What? Right. My soul existed inside the Monado. It was fated that I be released. It was shown to me in a vision. At last, the time finally came. And then... The people who found the Monado and freed it awoke Sansa. He sucked the lies from them so he could live. Ah. Shulk was among them. Shulk was already dead. That's impossible. We grew up together. Mm -hmm. You grew up with an empty shell. He appeared to live because I became his life force. That is until he had matured as my new vessel and become worthy of wielding the Monado. Allowing me to truly awaken and finally return. Lord Zanza is the soul of the Bionis, but he still needs a living body. Just like Mayneth over there. Huh. That's pretty like interesting. Don't make me laugh. But why use Shulk? What was it that made you select Shulk as your vessel? There was no particular reason. Shulk merely happened to be there at the time. There you have it. Anybody would have done. As long as they could swing a sword around, at least. So then, 
Shulk's ability to use the Monado. And those visions that he used to save us. All because of Lord Zanza. Exactly. Lord Zanza Thanks, Zanza. A passage of faith. He simply led you to the inevitable. The destruction of Colony 9. The death of that pompous old high end here fool. And that grunt Gado's miserable demise. All of it. Evil. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, There's fuck more. the gun blade. <laughs> we haven't even got to the best part. I'm what still explaining the fucking story. Don't you get it? You're just in the way. The lot of you. This world was created by Lord Zanza. By the very Bionis itself. Then you things think you can just spring up all over the place. All life that is born from me must be returned to me eventually to complete the cycle. For me to continue my existence as before, then all must be restored to its former order. In other words, the destruction and recreation of the world. Nothing more to it. First, we must eliminate my greatest obstacle. You, Maynard, the Maconic. This is. This goes hard. I love giant backs. I've been waiting. Waiting for this day. <laughs> how easy. Alright. How quickly the villains become the heroes in this is quite fun. I think the wings on the the other Monado, the one that Zanza's holding, what? is a little much, but overall that design is quite dope. It's That's so cool. Damn. Slice the head off too. God, I don't even know what to say, honestly, at this point. So you have finally this is the your big climax. And there was me thinking you would die Ooh. with dignity. I finally understand. The futures of our children belong to them alone. Though we are their creators, their lives are theirs to control. Even if the passage of fate is as you have decided, I will teach you the strength of their will to resist. Man, Zimbabwe's got a theme of uh, <laughs> of the big bad evil guy fighting the good, powerful woman. <laughs> 
with the fight. with their monados to fight for them. with their special That's swords right. we won't let you erase everyone's futures oh no oh no <laughs> oh god what he won is that all you Oh, 1v1. I don't really play, uh... Is that the only line you have? Is that the only- is that the only line you have? Is that, all you've got? Is that the only line you have? Is that all you've got for voice lines? Is that all you've got? Damn, I love the wings, though. God. Oh, I love... This is, like, this genre. Like, this... What is, what happening right now is, is, like, my favorite. Like, RPG, anime, sci-fi... With w swords and wings, <laughs> you know, like this is just everything I love, man. So that's why the dead boy is important to you. The homes are nothing but bacteria clinging to my body. They are living beings. If you cannot, I mean, bacteria is living, isn't it? You have no right to call yourself a god. And who decides that? A god, no, 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 no. because only a god. I, bruh, face me like a god or die like a mortal, baby. Sheesh. Such a fool. Dude. This is what I wish. This world belongs to you all. Ooh. So Maineth is no part of, no longer part of, uh, Oh, damn. So Maynard's no longer part of Fiora. Are they going to disappear? Oh? Oh, damn. <laughs> I got another one! Damn. That's also a fucking dope ass sword. Holy shit, these swords are so anime as fuck. It's a bear. He's gone. And things ain't looking good for us. No, they are not. Holy fuck, this is literally just a movie right now. I'm just commentating over a movie. I feel like <laughs> Let it begin. Wait wasteful? I don't know. I feel like I'm not adding too much to this. I'm I'm, I'm sorry. This is insane. Oh shit! He's like absorbing everyone. Is this like straight? You must. No, this isn't straight up the ending. Still time remaining. All hope. Damn, the arm up. 
dude, the visuals are so clean in this game. In all in all Xenoblade games. Like they they did not need to put that scene in, but they put it in because it was fucking powerful. Oh, that was clean. The hand up signifying he's reaching for the sky, but also like showing that like he's too far, you know, like oh. And also sort of like the final like uh, kind of like he's dying, you know. But his, it, this is like his last. He only has enough to put up one arm, dude. So clean. Go in peace. Let's go. We're leaving the Maconis. Ryan, take care of Shaw. Got it. Ah, uh, you okay? Yes. Yeah, I was gonna say, is she gonna be fine without Lanny Maynath? Like, was Maynath? really part of her works. like body the whole place is gonna blow we like must return to jumps what kept it running factory. let's go but i don't think that's Thunder. the case what about egil he'll fight zanza to the very end but we have our part of the bargain once he's gone we're the only ones left let's move everyone we are really like the only people left on earth at this point Goodbye, my brother Okay, I'm I'm double checking, making sure that uh, like all is good. Oh okay, yeah, I think I'm gonna probably switch Charlotte and Ricky up front right now. I really only ever played Shulk, so at this point, at this point, I don't know what to do. So. I have a feeling that we'll probably- look at Ricky spin, that's hilarious. I have, to, I have a feeling that we'll probably get Shulk back not too long from now, but... Bro, I can't believe Zanza is Ness, honestly. And Dixon has been Sans this whole time. Playing this game has uh, made me realize that I think for, like, the best of series, this is completely unrelated to what's going on, but I think for the best of series on my channel where I post clips of the best things to happen in the channel in each year, because the end of the year is coming up, I think um, I'm going to I'm gonna put a disclaimer every year now to be like, these are the games that are, are shown in the clips so spoilers for any of these games because like i i if i use something from here like i don't want to accidentally spoil something just in case uh also can i just teleport somewhere yeah okay I thought I was being stupid running here, because I'm like, usually you gotta run to these places, but I thought, I'm like, everybody in the comments, or not even the comments, but everybody watching this video are gonna be like, oh my god, he could teleport, what a dumbass, you know? Don't worry guys, I am using my brain sometimes. I thought, honestly, how that was playing out, I'm like, this is gonna be, it was basically 16 minutes of a cutscene, but I was like, this is gonna be the entire episode. It's just gonna be me watching this cutscene, and I'm like, I try my best not to just upload cutscenes of games and stuff, even with my commentary over it. I try to commentate as much as possible if that is the case, you know? So I was like, I was worried. So I'm glad that there's at least a little bit of me just talking about nonsense to fill some parts of it. It was a big guy. Looks like it's all over. Yep, I knew, I know even though I wasn't there. I want to thank you for what you did for my son. But we have to escape here. Shall we go back to the village? I mean, if that's the only place we got, we got to go to. If I don't finish it in this episode, the game, which I don't think I will, uh, 
I might record more of this this week. It's just getting real late. And I can't stay up all night playing this. Oh, shout out to Agil. I think a sign of great storytelling is how you can make someone a villain. Um... Like, you can make someone a realistic villain, like Agil, who has realistic, like, motives, and then immediately switch him to the hero and make it believable. You know what I mean? I think that's a really, like, that's what, the, not necessarily what's happening in Digimon Survive, but that sort of mentality of, like, I hate this guy, he's so fucking obnoxious, and then you're like, fuck, I feel bad for him. You know, like, being able to switch your emotions, like, fast about everything and make it work and feel right I think is a sign of like really good writing because you see Egil is objectively a monster but like I don't think of that anymore he's doing he's trying to save everyone now like now I sort of sympathize with him but like he fucking turned people into mechons It's finding common ground with your enemy. Are those it's Telethia? <laughs> I was gonna say they look like Telethia, but Oh god, do we gotta fight Telethia? No, we gotta fight Dixon? You're not getting away. Dixon! Listen. Man, we have to fight Dixon over. and a Telethia. Time for you all to return to the Bionis. Nice and quietly. That's enough! Why, Dixon? What made you like this? Shulk looked up to you, respected you! Dixon! Don't let Danza control you! Wake up! You can quit your belly aching. I'm in total control. I've always been like this. Ever since long before any of you lot were born. Before we were born? Now you get it. It's He's just like Eggles. The said. guy. He's the other I'm guy. Lord Zanza's disciple. Dixon of the Trinity. Dixon of the Trinity. Okay. Let's see what the heck let's figure our life here. Um Oh wait, can I What is what is considered the front? Uh, I'm I'm so lost without Shulk, honestly. I really like our vibe. Telethia are already kind of annoying to fight, and then now I don't... And then I get one shot. Okay. Uh, okay. Well, we'll see if I can... Oh, I hope I'm not, like, screwed at this point where it's like, Oh, you didn't grind enough. Well, you, sh you should have grinded, because now you gotta fight the Telethia. <laughs> you know? Uh, I 
genuinely what do we what do we even do at this point oh, okay it's okay cool i'm like what i you waste of space not so tough without shulk eh stupid beast yeah we aren't great without shulk you should be grateful not everyone has a war buddy like me to lead them along tasted good didn't they the victory drinks we used to share he's so he's been that so he's been dixon of the trinity like the whole time it's not like he touched the monado and got corrupted that's fascinating are you all right ah his brother or her brother He works for the Bionis. He shot Shulk in the back. Is this true? Yeah. Dixon. What if no one believe anyone in this, this damn game? Here. Your Telethia are no match for our Havre squadron. You cannot win. Maybe you should be concentrating on your own people instead of barking at me. What? Looks like you've forgotten your destiny. Right? Lorathea? Lorathea? Are you involved in this as well? Mm. Your Highness, your naivety is quite charming, but it is also your undoing. <laughs> I had much fun playing with you and your father. Damn. What, what is this blight? Ether particles emitted so that the Bionis can be destroyed and reborn. <laughs> what do you get if you cross high concentrations of ether with high entia? N no, you wouldn't, Lorathea. Awaken, my darling pets. Big Telethia? <laughs> I don't know what we get when we do that. Oh, they are Telethia. They are Telethia. Lorathea! Let him go! You misunderstand. Kinda of too late. This is the reason why High and Tear are born. Do not blame poor old me. Explain yourself. They're I keep like saying this, says, but they're kind of like the blades. The are a race created by Lord Zanza to eliminate any annoying life forms in the preparation for the rebirth of the Bionis. Like Their ether forms. That when the time comes, Telethia. Transforms them into Telethia. Or, like ether, they create the Hyentia and can't then they be. form into Save the Telethia. Melia, it is true. That is why. You are our only hope. Is it because she doesn't have the gene? Brother? Whatever. We won't be needing a half-breed like you anyway. Oh, I mean, nice. If you don't turn into a Telethia, it just means you're going to get crushed by one. You just hump That's the screen. That's the thing you're good for. <gasps> Rise up, pet. Do my bidding. Kill your lovely sister. God, there's so much of like, what do we even fucking do at this point? Like, we're so fucked. Just hold on! I'll find a way to save you! Me Melia! So sorry! I always placed such a heavy burden on you! Destiny of our people. The burden meant for you brings a tear to my eye. These moments are to be treasured. <gasps> How? Hmm? 
Is he controlling the Telethia? It's the power of will, baby. Brother! Melia! Father's wish and the future of the High Entia are in your hands. Yours and Shulk's! <gasps> Telethia! Destroy him! Jeez. Wait, is that actually taking out Dixon? Damn, bro. Callian fucking... Jesus, everybody's dope and dying. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Fucking hell. Uh, it's either, If it's not chapter 16, it must go to, like, 18 or something. I think I looked it up one time, but I got... I have to end it here, and I gotta go to bed, honestly. I don't know how I sleep after this. Um... Jesus. I'm texting my friend Dixon of the Trinity. So he'll 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 look at that and be like, oh, and then when he's watching this video, he'll be like, <laughs> I got that at like three in the morning. Okay, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Fucking crazy. We are very close to the ending, it seems. Uh thank you guys so much for watching. Shulk's dead. Have a good have a good night. Bye.